This is an ABC News special report. Now reporting, David Muir. Good afternoon. We're coming on the air because just moments ago, amid global concern and speculation, Princess Catherine has now revealed her personal health battle and why she kept it secret. The Princess of Wales releasing a video a short time ago sharing she is being treated for cancer. She says she underwent major abdominal surgery in January, which we reported at the time. And she says that at the time, her doctors thought her condition was non-cancerous. After the operation, tests showed there was cancer present. And the princess says the surgery was a success that she's now undergoing preventative chemotherapy. She calls the diagnosis a huge shock in her words to both her and Prince William. Catherine also revealing it has taken time for her to come forward because she first wanted to explain the condition to their three young children and let them know she's going to be okay. Here's Princess Catherine in a recorded statement released just moments ago by the royal family. Us me, for all the wonderful messages of support and for your understanding, whilst I've been recovering from surgery. It has been an incredibly tough couple of months for our entire family, but I've had a fantastic medical team who have taken great care of me, for which I'm so grateful. In January, I underwent major abdominal surgery in London, and at the time, it was thought that my condition was non-cancerous. The surgery was successful. However, tests after the operation found cancer had been present. My medical team therefore advised that I should undergo a course of preventative chemotherapy, and I'm now in the early stages of that treatment. This, of course, came as a huge shock, and William and I have been doing everything we can to process and manage this privately for the sake of our young family. As you can imagine, this has taken time. It has taken me time to recover from major surgery in order to start my treatment, but most importantly, it has taken us time to explain everything to George, Charlotte and Louis in a way that's appropriate for them and to reassure them that I'm going to be okay. As I've said to them, I am well and getting stronger every day by focusing on the things that will help me heal in my mind, body and spirits. Having William by my side is a great source of comfort and reassurance too, as is the love, support and kindness that has been shown by so many of you. It means so much to us both. We hope that you'll understand that as a family, we now need some time, space and privacy while I complete my treatment. My work has always brought me a deep sense of joy and I look forward to being back when I'm able. But for now, I must focus on making a full recovery. At this time, I'm also thinking of all those whose lives have been affected by cancer. For everyone facing this disease, in whatever form, please do not lose faith or hope. You are not alone. The statement from Princess Catherine from Buckingham Palace just moments ago, an extraordinarily raw and personal statement uh, from the princess herself talking about how she is now undergoing preventative chemotherapy for cancer that was discovered in tests that followed that abdominal surgery that we reported uh, back in January. As you know, back in January, Buckingham Palace only revealed that she was undergoing that surgery, was not expected to resume royal duties until around Easter. She was mostly out of the public eye, appearing with Prince William at a farm in Windsor just a few days ago. There was video of that uh, seen around the world, a Mother's Day photo of Princess Catherine and her children raising questions when it was learned that the photo was digitally altered. Catherine undergoing surgery at the same time and at the same facility as King Charles, who revealed he was being treated for a prostate issue. Uh, the palace uh, later informing the public that he has cancer uh, and is being treated for that. They have not specified which type.